previously on the coin flip trip. With a high flip to kick off the coin flip trip in Lima, Peru, Matt and I lived a day of ultimate luxury. A five-star hotel, a spa day, and an 18-course meal at one of the world's most renowned restaurants. It can be lonely at the top, so while it's great to stay in an amazing hotel, we've decided to go where the people are. We're choosing to go to a $9 hostel, and we'll have a lot of extra money to get creative and do whatever we want to do with, Definitely. maybe help some people out, maybe buy some drinks for people at the hostels. Yeah. Who Sky's knows? the limit today. <laughs> yeah. This is nice. This is great. This is a hostel. I like it. Look at this. I already offered this room up. I said, Maddie, if uh, you know things go in a certain direction tonight, and you want to, you want this room, and you want me to take your dorm room, I would do that for him. I would do that for him. If you want to meet people, go to a hostel. We only just got here, and we've already made friends. And so we went to the fancy hotel and we had yeah. a great time. And then we woke up this morning and we we're like, we want to go meet people. I'd just like to point out that even with all this money, Matt willingly chose to sleep in a dorm room. And we want to. Yeah. So you booked a, a room in a hostel purely to. Just to be in a hostel. No, that, 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 and that that's makes successful. sense. No, I okay. get that. So that's why I have the. I got the private room. Yeah. We're splurging. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Splurging within so, the context of a hostel. So what are you, what uh, are you gonna spend actually, $500 on well, With over $900 left between us and a thriving city to explore, the options are endless. Except we've just received a challenge from one of our Thirst Lounge co-hosts, Justin. While on the road, our hosts will be given challenges they must complete. During a low flip, they will have the chance to earn additional money or prizes if they complete the challenge. During a high flip, Adam and Matt must complete the challenge or they risk losing cash. But, yeah. all right, here we go. This is one of our guys. friends. Hey guys, what's going on? I hope you're having fun in Peru. Here's the deal. You have six challenges. You have to complete four of them today or you lose half your budget for tomorrow. Good luck. So we have to complete four of the six challenges. One, get a selfie with a llama. Two, eat peanut butter fruit. Three, eat guinea pig. Four, eat quail eggs from a street market. Five, pet a cat in Kennedy Park. And six, find a new friend to join this challenge. Six so, challenges, baby. Oh, eat a guinea four pig, no. <laughs> All right, okay. Do you guys want oh, yeah, to do? I think, yeah, I think we got doodle. six already. We gotta eat a yeah. Pig then, yeah. Adam is the biggest loophole artist I've ever known. If there's a way to skirt the rules, he's gonna find it. Uh, it doesn't it say that it has manageable. to be a live uh, llama. Hello, llama. <laughs> Hello, llama. <laughs> David, uh, what? get out. Lima. We just took a picture with two llamas. How many llamas do you want? This is a llama! This is two of them! This is right, right. Just checking up. I'm, I'm putting it. What do you mean? How much more llama does it get? Hello, llama. We're headed to a local market to find the peanut butter fruit, guinea pigs, and quail eggs. <laughs> what did you look? You did the research on this. What I did just, you read? I just typed in markets oh near us just on Google. Talked in, typed in a market. We're not going to like the best market in Lima or anything? No, this one, it had at least four stars. All right, four star market. Being able to speak Spanish is a huge advantage. Well, it would be if anyone knew what on earth a peanut butter fruit was. Tiene mucho cia. Mucho cia. Sé que es como mucho cia. Mucho cia, una fruta. Mucho cia. They've got like 30 different types of fruit, but not one buncho sia. This is proving to be a lot more difficult than we thought. Name of that? Uh-huh. <laughs> It doesn't exist right now, Brando. <laughs> we are not in the Amazon, Brando. This is our producer, Brando. He wants us to find a fruit that grows in the Amazon. We are in Lima. It is October. Thanks, Brando. This is a seasonal <laughs> item. <laughs> it's not available. It's, 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 it's not possible. Well, that's where you're wrong, Adam. Anything's possible if you just put your mind to it. Well, Maybe not this one thing. This is what I'll do for Adam. We'll, we will count the llama. Yeah! <laughs> no, 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 you can do better than the llama. 
Do you it. are uninvited. <laughs> but we got the llama. We got the llama. We got the llama. We, got the llama. we, got the llama. we came here to this fruit yeah. market and they were very, very generous, just giving us all different types of fruit. We ordered some, it was only $3.70 in soles, and we just gave them the 50 and told them to keep it. We gotta use the money somehow, and you know, using it on generous people who are kind enough to let us eat all these different types of fruits. Seems like a pretty okay. decent way to do it. Got a nice actually. Two challenges down, two more to go. Now we're on the hunt for Kui, aka guinea pig, if we don't complete two more challenges, we'll both lose $250 each from our budget tomorrow. She said no, and I was like, do you know anywhere where they might have it? And she was like, no. <laughs> We're so screwed. They're like, they know what it is, mm -hmm. Koi, but they're like, no, we definitely don't know where it is. Koi? Koi? No, koi. No, no, koi. No, koi. Ah, koi. 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 No, no. No, no. You want to eat that? You're insane. I don't think it's as common as you think, Fred. Because people are like, you're going to eat that? You're crazy. They're, they're, they're like, hey, you wanted koi. This guy wanted koi. What is he insane? Koi. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, they definitely don't eat that here. It's very like fatty. <laughs> <laughs> it is not common. Nice. Finding a guinea pig to eat wasn't looking that promising, but given our experience last night, we'd rather take everyone to a nice ceviche lunch anyway. One of these, which is a massive plate of ceviche, is 20 soles, which is about six dollars for like a really nice ceviche. Doesn't really get more authentic than this than this whole uh, little restaurant eating yeah. ceviche. On our way to Kennedy Park to find a cat to pet, we happen upon a street vendor selling quail eggs. Jackpot! Oh, gracias, thank you. Gracias. Gracias. Thank you. Kennedy Park is smack dab in the middle of Miraflores, Lima. This place is known for the cats that have lived there for over 20 years. Most people love it. Matt, not so much. I'm not much of a cat person. I've been a dog person my whole life. I have been bitten by a cat. I've been bitten by a monkey. I've been bitten by a duck. I've been bitten by a rat before. What the hell did you just say? There we Aww. go. Wow, this is Beautiful. a very like adorable Thank cat, you. actually. Oh, and it doesn't here. look like you have rabies at all. An egg for everyone. Oh boy. Right. Pass it around. Celebratory egg. Celebratory <laughs> oh, quail yeah, egg. Yeah. Thank you guys. Here we go. Guys. Thank you, oh, thank you for joining us today. Yeah. Cheers. Oh, completing Sleep. everything. Sleep Congratulations. Oh, yeah. Now we get to drink. <laughs> yeah, pretty good. Cheers it's to like typhoid. Yeah, it's an egg. It's delicious. <laughs> an egg, yeah. I don't know what we expected. Yeah. It's an egg. We did it. Our budget for tomorrow is safe, but we're running out of time to spend today's money. As a, as a thank you for helping us uh, complete our challenges, let's have Burr. some Pisco. A little Pisco with a few friends is great, but you know what's even better? A lot of Pisco with a lot of friends. Let's do a Pisco bottle. The biggest thing that we can find. We're buying bottles straight from the bar, pouring drinks for everyone, buying food for everyone, gambling on rock, paper, scissors. Let's just say it's not a typical spending for a hostel bar. One, two, three. Oh! One, two, three. Okay. Right. Five. I am unstoppable! I am the hey, best Russian ball player of all time! Thank you so much. <laughs> At one point, our spending gets capped for our own protection when we hit $200. But we paid that bill, explained our situation, and opened that faucet right back up. There you go. We tried to spend the money, we really did. But it turns out you don't need a thousand dollars to have an incredible time in Lima. For a few hundred bucks, we kept the drinks flowing all night. We had more fun hanging out with everyone and sharing drinks than we did in the fancy hotel by ourselves. 
When I travel, my favorite part is connecting with people I never would have met otherwise and becoming fast friends and adventure buddies. And that's what today was all about. And if we're lucky, maybe some of that karma will come back around when we need it most. Next time on the Coin Flip Trip. I want both of you to get to Huacachina without spending a single dime. Mexico, Mexico, sir, Mexico. If we lose, we give you money. We got two solos. All right, we're hustling them. Yeah. <laughs> I feel a little bit bad.